I think my favorite part about playing volleyball here is definitely the weight room. I'll miss workouts and the whole staff, Coach D, Coach Mike, and Jack. That's probably, every time I walk in the weight room, it's like a breath of fresh air. It's just really fun being in there. So that's definitely something I'm really going to miss. Yeah. Um, I'm probably just going to miss the competitive nature just because I'm a competitive person. So being able to go out there on the court every day and just like compete is something that I'm really going to miss. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like it's the same like I just agree because like I love I love going in the weight room because it is it's a different it's just a different atmosphere it's like you walk in and it's like boom time to get like time to get stuff done and then like I don't know I think I'll just miss playing in general just because I've been playing it for forever so it's gonna be different to not be playing it anymore yeah I'm probably gonna miss uh, the girls definitely just being like being, if you ever need anything, like everybody's so close to one another, like just everybody being on campus, and so like everybody, like these girls that are gonna be off elsewhere after college, like that's probably gonna be what I miss the most. My favorite memory would probably be just Nabir, just because uh, it's different, obviously, but just being able to come into the volleyball, like, and have such great support and everything, and then. You just get to escape from like the whole core. Like that's like the best part. Of course, like you get to do that uh, as you're older too. But like it's just different. Like just being able to like let free and like let loose and just enjoy things so much more. Nabir during volleyball. So. Yeah, being able to come in the locker room during Nabir. I remember we'd all just go in the locker room and we'd just sit there and we'd like take a deep breath and then everybody would just let out whatever it was that was going on or whatever problems or whatever issues. And then we try to, I guess we try to help as much as we could because realistically we all can't really help each other. <laughs> but I really think that that was probably my favorite memory. It's just all the times that we spent in the locker room because we were in there. <laughs> we used to make really funny videos, especially around Christmas time. <laughs> Christmas video. <laughs> I think my favorite memory is just watching how much we've grown through this, throughout the like years that we've been here because we came in like we were so young and then now we're leaving and. I don't know, it's just, oh, I need to see the growth. I made it. Like, yeah. It's yeah. more It's it's more of a, I made it through than like the diploma is. It's like I went through all of it, I made through all of it. I'm victorious. <laughs> I win. Yeah. Um. Uh, well, my dad graduated from here, so it was awesome to get my ring and like finally like I've seen my brothers like clank rings together, and so it was awesome just to like <laughs> finally be able to do that with my dad. And um, it just I, means that you're always gonna like have that journey with you and those memories with you, and it's like all of that in one just symbolizes that I don't know that we all have, are connected in some yeah. way. It's like we're all like a big group. Yeah. Like yeah. if you have if you got the ring, like oh I went through the same things that you went through. It's like, yeah. Oh, what year did you graduate? Yeah. Like, everyone has always something a conversation in common. Started. Yeah. Very rich. I'm not kidding. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm definitely taking a gap year just <laughs> yeah. uh, and then eventually go to PA school because I want know once I start PA school that's going to be commitment in and of itself. So, yeah. PA school. Hmm. Um, I started Duke nursing school on January 8th. So, so I'm, I'll also be probably taking a gap year and uh, then hopefully manufacturing airplanes or something along that, those lines. So. I mean, marrying rich is always a good goal, but um, I'm going to go into human resources, some big top business, so catch me in a suit.